include broken valves, blown gaskets, leaking relief valve, and worn main bearings. Blown gaskets and leaking relief valves recirculate hot discharge gas into the motor housing. Worn bearings cause a decrease in the air gap between the rotor and stator, which heats up the motor. If the bearing wears enough, the rotor can even come in direct contact with the stator, causing it to short. To summarize this section on troubleshooting, here is a list of the operating conditions for O6D and O6E compressors we've mentioned. Discharge temperature should not exceed 275 degrees Fahrenheit measured 6 inches from the discharge service valve. With POE oil applications, 250 degrees Fahrenheit is the maximum recommended operating temperature. Motor barrel temperature should not generally exceed 80 to 125 degrees Fahrenheit depending on application. Note, O6CC may run hotter. Crankcase temperature should not exceed 165 degrees Fahrenheit. Oil level should be maintained at 1 quarter to 3 quarters of the sight glass for O6Ds and 1 eighth to 3 eighths for O6Es. The major points covered in the troubleshooting section were oil pressure safeties, operating limits, identifying problems, and overheating. That concludes our program on the proper analyzing and servicing procedures for most field repair situations of the Carlisle model O6D, O6E, and O6CC compressors. In this program, we covered familiarization, field servicing, and troubleshooting.